Oh my god, you found the kid a drum, right? Is, is this for him? Can he have it? Yeah, here, it's yours. Enjoy. Oh, thank you so much. He is so excited and grateful. He's not going to let you down. This was a good use of your time. Thank you so much. Well, what do you know? Fuck it. That fucker's pretty good. Portal door, warp base, anything. I don't care. Just get it to me right now. Wait. Never mind. I'm not hungry. Bye. Like we talked about, we got a customer! May it fill your days with wonder. TGIP, am I right, bounty hunter? Thank God it's Boobs Day! Save your life, because tomorrow it's gonna be rock bottom again. Hey, bounty hunter, if my son says anything that offends you, uh, let me know. I don't care if I fed this piece of shit, Gublo. Jorb, how could you say such a thing? I'm so sorry, bounty hunter. They don't even know what Gublo means. That doesn't make it okay. I hate to part with that. Look how dumb they look trying to figure out what to buy. See you soon, bounty hunter. Personal space. Knobs. I mean, wah, 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 wah. Nice. The one channel you watch. Oh my God, that guy's jokes were fucking awful, but his body made me laugh so hard. I'd go back. I don't think the comedian was very funny, but uh, I did really get a few laughs out of watching his body. I couldn't believe it. I went there as a skeptic. I... Oh, 
Gary fell down and broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. Gary and Jill ran up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell down. All right, here's the skinny. You're all gonna need some major firepower if you really plan to take on Garmantuous. What? More, more than we already have? Uh, our team is mostly guns. Trust me, we need this. Plug sent over the details on an extremely powerful Gatlion. Oh shit, another Gatlion! That's right. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer. A scientist named Dr. John Giblets. And guess what? I can't find shit on him. I don't even know where he is. Okay, so what do we do? We do it the old-fashioned way. And ask around. Maybe we find out his coordinates and warp him in. I'm sending you to Blim to gather intel. I don't know. I'm fucking tired, kid. Maybe you'll appreciate me more if you do my job. Okay, Gene, all right. We'll, we'll, we'll try to find him ourselves. All right. Skip the portal door and just head out into Blim. Oh, and before you go, you might need a little extra help. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're welcome. Bounty Hunter, it's me, Sudo, again. I'm still here. I've been here the whole time. Welcome to detective mode. I'm here to help you sleuth out all those really big, crazy mysteries. Suddenly? With the fucking detective mode? Well, why haven't we had access to this the whole time? All right, let's see. It looks like you're looking for a... Dr. John Giblets. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. Oh, fantastic. Let me do a quick search for you. This will solve it immediately, and... No matches found. Oh, well, it's never that easy. Why don't you start by interrogating the locals? Okay, I figured it out. This thing's fucking useless. Thanks, Gene. Dispatch 146. You have a 1052 double VOA call at the Dickens That made it look like a show, but look at it this way. Huh? Oh man, the scanner could be helpful if you want to use it. I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to be pushy. It's only if you want it. Hey, uh, did, did you know anything about Dr. Giblets? What are you talking about? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. Looks like you're trying to interrogate a suspect. Let's ask them some questions. I can't tell. I can't tell if you're looking at me. That's the hardest part. Do I look nervous? <laughs> oh, jeez, you're making me nervous with this interrogation. I love you, okay? I'm really sorry. I don't know who that is, but <laughs> good luck. I guess. Hope you find them. Woof! They didn't know anything. That was a real D-rank interrogation. Sorry. Oh well. Maybe you could just find more people to interrogate. You'll get it next time. Oh, whoops. sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> this is the trial version of detective mode, so there's going to be ads. You love ads. This will be worth it, I promise. Hey, uh, hey, tough guy. We're we're looking for a Doctor Giblets. You got you got any leads? Slick. What the fuck are you talking like that for? Oh, Jesus Christ! Leave me alone. I don't know, and I don't give a shit. I'm busy. You need anything else, or can I fucking go? Quick, the drug guys. No! I don't have any fucking ties to the evil drug conglomerate. I'm a normal person trying to live a normal life in the city. Why in the fuck would I have any ties to the G3? Ooh, bummer, they were a tough cookie. But they were telling the truth according to my sensors, so let's say that was a C-rank interrogation. Uh, no. Better luck next time, exactly. let's look for somebody else. The fuck is wrong with this crowd? Just open the gates! I don't want to miss the Hyperbon 6 midnight launch at High on Life! Do your best and have fun. You think I forgot you sided with this dipshit instead of me? Nope, I didn't. Fuck off. Oh, look at this. Suddenly, everybody wants to get into the dirty old slums just because High on Life is doing another big midnight lunch. The store's new, too. That's gentrification for you. I know it sounds like I'm being critical, but I'm actually pro-gentrification. I love it. Do you mind if we have a moment of your time? Oh, uh, sure. Uh, what's this about, can I ask? Shh, 
Hey, quiet. Don't say his name so loud. I can't help you, but Blordo can. Mention my name, Michael Taint. Then he'll talk, but no cracks about my name. Well, sure. Yeah, I don't really have any moral issue with accepting a bribe. It sounds like a win-win, actually. I get money, you get info. But uh, come to think of it, the G3 will kill me, so uh, how about no? Holy shit, wow, you, we actually got something we can use. Okay, woo -hoo. that was an A-rank interrogation. Good for you. Let's head over to Blurdo and mention Michael Taint. Bounty Hunter, you look hungry. Let me help you out. Hey, what's up, Lordo? Y you know anything about a, a, a where we could find a guy named Jib Dr. Giblets? Whoa, 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 where'd you hear that name? You can't just go asking around town for a guy like that. What, why? What, what, what's wrong with asking about Dr. Giblets? I don't know. Why do you think I know anything about Dr. Giblets? I don't know nothing. Now buy something or beat it, buster. Ah, oh, that piece of shit! I'm gonna kill him! Ah, look, if you're really looking for trouble, maybe check out the new High on Life store in the slums. The Hyperbong 6 Midnight launch is tonight, but you should be able to get in by now. Just don't mention my name. I didn't say nothing. Now get out of here! If anyone sees me talking to you, I'm dead! Thanks, Blordo. We, we had a good feeling you were a true pal. Whoa! Great sleuthing, detectives! That was an s rank interrogation! I'll show it to you from all angles. Here, you see it this way. Now I'm gonna turn, and you see it this way. Now I'm gonna turn, this is the- Oh shit! This is the angle you got. Hey, this is my favorite VIP. Hey, you don't have to wait through any of this Let funny business. In. You are allowed right in, line, in my friend. Yeah, you better head straight through. I don't want tricks like you me. hanging around. Shit, thank you. Okay, so we're looking for this new high on life store. Hopefully oh, yeah, the slums hey, hey, are a little yeah. more chill uh, now that we took out nine to torg. To me. I'm the broken leg guy. Hey, Nobody wants to talk to the broken leg guy. For I get it. Well, the torgs are with the G3 now, so it's best not to stick your nose where where it don't. Wait. Oh shit! It's you. The bounty hunter's back. Everyone, get him. We don't. Have to
I guess this time I ruined your picnic. Trick hole, what's so gross about that? Is it three now? We must be on the right trail if they're coming at us this hard. Come on, let, let's get to this high on life place. Oh, this feels good. This place, it's, it just feels weird.
thought you were done with me. There we fucking go. We made it to High on Life. Thank God they opened this new High on Life store. I've been counting down. Detectives can always cut lines. The rules do not oh, apply I just to the law. Make me buy a new adapter. I need the new hyperbong. You don't understand. This isn't like a consumer loyal. Seven nine two three, your local Hyperbong Superstore. Please, no trampling of other patrons during the midnight launch. Well, well, well. I smell another mystery. I'm Pseudo, by the way. You know me. Uh, yeah, we're, we're still tracking down giblets. Yeah, you already know what I'm gonna say. Try interrogating all the employees here. Uh, yeah, no shit. That's what, that's what the fuck we're gonna do. Hello, and welcome to High on Life. How can High on Life help you today? We actually prefer not to call it the slums. This is an exciting new up-and-coming part of town that we hope will attract a youthful new demographic ready to spend their hard-earned money on quality products. Speaking of which, can I interest you in a Hyperbong 6? High on Life employees are not authorized to admit that we have ties to the criminal organization known as the G3, but can I offer you membership in our High on Life care program? Woo, these are some tough nuts to crack. Don't lose motivation, you're doing great, but you do get a D ranking because that one sucked. It is my pleasure to welcome you to High on Life. Are you being helped already? High on Life employees politely request that you don't alert the other customers to the fact that we are part owned by the Torg family. That worries the other customers, and we don't want that. I'm so sorry. That is a really fantastic question, but I'm not authorized to answer it. Have you considered buying a drop-proof case for your Hyperbong? You know, I can't recall whether or not I've heard that name before. But I'm actually much more interested in telling you all about the fabulous features that come packed in with the brand new Hyperbong 6. Ooh, boy, they really want to make that commission, huh? Sorry, but I gotta give you another D rank. Oh, uh, 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 hello, uh, hello, and welcome, welcome to High on Life. I'm Barrick, and I'm gonna be a personal uh, High on Life uh, prof professional today. Um, do, do, that makes sense, right? That, does that sound okay? I'm, I'm new here. Hey, hey, it's my first day. Uh, can you do me a favor and not mention Dr. Giblets around here? They told us not to talk about him. God, I'd really love to help you because you look very cool. But no, sorry, I, I, I have no clue. Me? Oh, no, 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 I'm, uh, I'm straight edge. I don't even like thinking about drugs. This job was a, uh, it was a bad idea for me, probably. Wow, nice kid, but not helpful at all. You get a big fat D ranking. Holy shit, this is a madhouse. Oh, 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 sorry. Hi, thanks for shopping at High on Life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? That's right, it's a big day. I didn't think there'd be this many people lining up to buy Hyper Bongs. Probably a bad sign for our city. Oh man, this again. Look man, I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I'm, I'm kind of a fuck up. I lied on my resume. I got this manager gig. I never even met Dr. Giblets. I, I don't know what he looks like. I couldn't even point him out in a crowd. But, but you know about him. Yeah, yeah, sure I do. He owns this place. He never comes around though. I don't really know where he is. What? 
I told you, I have no idea where he is. And you're being really aggressive. Leave me alone. It's super fucking busy right now, and you're distracting the hell out of me. Okay, shit, not, not so good. It looks like we uh, hit, a, hit a dead end, so let's get the fuck out of here and just give up on being detectives. It's all done now. Nice day for a shopping trip, ain't it? It sure is. I know I'd go shopping on a day like this. Except this wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. That's right. Seems like they're poking their beak where I don't belong. Be a shame if something happened to your beak as a result if you catch our drift. More of this shit? Are you fucking kidding me? More? More of this? Why is everybody on our case today? Please, just fuck off! You got a fresh mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Part of my associate here, he's only got one good threat, but I assure you, he can back it up. That's right. A word to the wise. Stay out of this. Got it? We've got this covered. What the hell was that? Excuse me? Holy shit! What the fuck? Was this guy trampled to death? Uh, yeah. My friend Davy Glutes. Got trampled in the rush. Pretty sad, right? One moment he was there, next he's gone. Squashed. Oh, you can go ahead and take his bag boots. It's not a problem. He was a really bad guy. Like morally, he was very fucked up. Bad morals? Shouldn't have been friends with him, really. Not really a good idea. <laughs> I don't know really why I liked him so much. Yeah, that's fine. You can totally take those mag boots. Okay, look, I know this is a little fucked, but these boots are gonna be very useful and, and they're the only way out of here, well, you know? Hey, sick moves! You're making good use of those mag boots. You're using those things way better than Dave Boots ever did.
reason! Use your last bit of strength to throw me to safety! Hey, don't forget about my time bubble! Welcome back. We've got company. Hello there. Oh, great. You fuckers again. Don't worry. They're cool. We've been observing you. Hope that don't rustle your jimmies none. Because newsflash buckos, we're on your side. We'd like to formally apologize for how we treated you earlier. We didn't realize who we were dealing with. You'll have to forgive us. And we're sorry we still sound like we're intimidating you. It's the only way we know how to talk. Our wives hate us. We represent Magistrate Clug Nugman. Maybe you've heard of him. He's certainly heard of you. Here's the skinny slim. The Torg family, or what's left of it anyway. They got mixed up with a bad crowd. The G3 cartel. Or more specifically, Dr. John Giblet's PhD. And Clug wants it squashed, pronto. He says you're the right bounty hunter for the job. Says you're already helping him. Says the G3 is our common enemy. We've got a lead on Dr. Giblet's. He's been whooping all over, leaving behind a nice little warp trail for us. We're thinking you can follow those breadcrumbs all the way to the gingerbread house. That way Clug don't have to get his cute little hands dirty. You dig? This kid's fast. Yeah, check out Dale Earnhardt Jr. over here. Let's say somebody dies. Maybe, hypothetically, their name is Dr. Giblets. Well, should anything like that happen, we had nothing to do with it. We didn't even mention it. This conversation never happened. And Clug will be very grateful. Speaking of which, why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. Oh, shit, yeah. Let's go see what Clug's been up to. Oh, welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been aces. Yeah, real pros. Oh, enough pleasantries. Let's keep this moving. Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. But look, you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but this election is really close. And, well, keeping the G3 out of Blim, it's really going to help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with... Dr. Giblets? Trust me, we're gonna blast them to pieces with or without you, but we just hit a dead end. A dead end? Oh no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what might be on it. Got it, that's where Dr. Giblets is. Whoa, whoa, even if this map data did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah, and then we get to, you know. Hey, hey, hey! I can't officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> Good luck out there, bounty hunter. We don't need luck. Fuck yeah, let's go kill Dr. Giblets. Vamoose, you goose. Thanks for helping our dad. We love our dad, Clug. They're my kids, yeah. Forgot to mention that. <laughs> Good boys, too. Magistrate Clug came through. He pointed us right to Dr. Giblets. That's great. I kind of regret not voting for him. Now get out there and kill Giblets. At night, when the mask is off, I look at myself. I may make the world. Yeah, good thing you like running so much, huh? Great eggs value. Oh, okay. We got eggs. Yes. Take 
good care of that now. Wow, how many years of college did it take for you to learn how to buy stuff? But he, he, he didn't know that we that we actually had to buy this website. I own it. Oh, see that loot? Two G's. I own it though. Okay, now that we've secured the domain and we're gonna finish up this commercial. <laughs> And Jill came tumbling after. At night, when the mask is off, I look at myself. I may make the world think I'm happy, but I can't hide the truth of myself. Whatever happens, I must go on acting, acting, acting. Be a polyachola. <laughs> Okay, Aunt Peng. I just thought maybe my mom and dad would be with you. Yes, I have tried everything. Well, I told... Looks like things have developed in a sort of weird way over here. Welcome to Highway Village. Our currency here is tires, and we sacrifice our younglings to the Lord Asphaltia, High God of the Way. Oh, 
God, you brought me back out! I am so sorry for whatever I did to make you not want to use me again for a while. I will never do whatever that was again. Somebody needed our help bad. It sounded like they were dying, man. Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, oh. We stumbled help. across another body. It looked like a classic case of... Hey, what happened to you? A G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well, it shot me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. A G3 There's... base. That can only mean one thing. Not sure what, though. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm fading fast. Please, please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I don't want to be alone. I don't want to be alone. Did they still have a half chance of survival? Who's to say? No way to know. Not even with all the blood and half their body missing. There's... We weren't going anywhere until it was over. No, no. It, it's my time to go. Oh, thank you for, for staying with me as I die. Oh, just, just don't leave. Okay. And I feel it. Here I go. Oh, I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh. And just like that, another candle is snuffed out in the wind. So cool. I, 